Okay people, welcome to another let's play indie game sort of thing and this time I'm going to be playing a game that just came out a few hours ago. It's called Season A Letter To The Future. Okay, press any button it says. I'm going to do just that. Okay. Let's just check the settings. It's recommended to play with a controller. But uh <laughs> I'm too lazy to to kind of grab my controller right now. Uh let's just get into it. Right? Who are you? Nah, the artwork, I'm telling you. That's the reason I wanted to play this game. Artwork. Um, the vibe, pretty much. Who are you? I don't know, but I'm writing to you anyway. Where are you? How far in the future? Where'd you find my journal? I may never know. But you can know me from what I put down on these pages. I come from a little village in the mountains. Nice. No one has left here since before I was born. But our lives changed overnight. Just a few days ago when my best friend had a prophetic dream. A vision that the Elder said means this season is going to end soon. The world is about to enter a new era. Okay. A great change is coming. Some sci-fi elements. Was afraid. I was surrounded by questions and I began to feel how little I know. What is this season that is about to end? And why is it ending? What exactly is out there that could turn the world inside out? If there are still voices singing and laughing in the wilderness, I could record them before they're gone. I also thought of my dad, who always wanted to see the outside world but never did. Nightlife in a plaza. So, I asked if I could leave. Wow, the artwork. The elder had one condition for letting me go. The Could elder. I take what I collect to the museum vault. The elder has a, a big head. A palace of art and memory at the edge of the earth. She says it's the only place safe from the turmoil of a changing season. Yeah, she has a big I head. I hope that's where you're reading this now. That's how you know it's sci-fi here. Over here. I can't stop the change that is coming, but this time on Earth could live, live on, on in, in these pages. pages. Okay. What it looks like, sounds like, how it feels to be alive right now. I'm writing to you at the crack of dawn on the morning mm -hmm. I leave home. I can smell breakfast cooking in the other room, and I can hear my mom's voice. Index, past seasons, a letter to the future of village in the mountains. Um, Ate's dream, the season is going to end. Dad, the museum vault. The morning I leave home. Okay. You can choose. Uh, Alright. Wow. This game looks good. Uh, so. A catalog of strangers. Here's some tales for blase children. Catalog of Strangers, an introduction to the more frightful as aspects of this world. Reasonable amount of fear and fun makes for prudent children. You can actually read it. Um, I hate reading, so... <laughs> Alright. There's something to grab here. 
Oh, you can ring this. Bell. Right. What's this? It's a... Three. <laughs> two. One. Hooray! What? Mr. Lotto's here. Okay, okay. That was creepy. Um... My bag and dad's camera. Okay. Ready for the great departure. Alright. Prize ribbon, ceramic animal, origami. Okay. Just checking out the room before we have to leave, I guess. Insect house old bill. Maybe I need to check out that old. The owl spread her wings over prosperity. <laughs> What's that? Mom and Dad's portrait, sketch of Dad. Yeah, I thought I was hearing things. It's actually our, our mom here. Um, good morning. You're up. It's gonna be a beautiful morning. I'm making progress. I found the burner, camera, recorder, travel bag. Breakfast is in progress. What does she mean by burner? I hope it's not gun. <laughs> Still gotta make a pendant. We haven't used this in so long. Pendant. What is that pendant? Good thing I saved the instructions. Just as you would use a shield to protect your body, an identity pendant protects your mind. Okay. Your thoughts, memories, everything that makes you... We don't wear them here in the village anymore. But if you're going into the outside world, I'll feel better when you've got a pendant shield in you. Okay. Sort of like a... Diseases of the mind. Diseases of the mind. Interesting. Like the dream sickness. Whoa. I want to ask a lot of questions, I guess. We don't know what caused it. We heard people suddenly fell into an eternal sleep. These were years of wild rumors, and half of them turned out to be true. In times of war, a pendant can be used to identify a body. <sighs> Let's skip that part. Objects have two layers, the physical and the mental. The pendant needs to absorb both. One, collect a sentimental object for each sense. Sound, Sound smell, feel, sight, taste. Two, feel the sense and speak aloud a memory of the object. Three, feed the object into the burner. What, what is going on? The memory will leave the speaker as it is transferred to the pendant. Memory will... I'm trying to digest all this. The memory will leave the speaker as it is transferred to the pendant. That means pendant. I forget the memory after I say it. It's supposed to be painless. At least. Wow. Wait. I, no. Yeah. You must remember everything. That's your role. I'm the rememberer. Okay, so... That's the burner. This old tape should work for our sense of sound. I remember. You and I fell asleep listening to this tape. Your dad came home. We all rested together until it got dark.
and then you burn it into the pendant. What an odd feeling. Like an absence disappearing. What? The empty space fills itself back in until I forget that I forgot anything at all. <sighs> I'm glad I'm only losing a few memories. If I lost too many, I wouldn't even know who you are. You should pick the rest of the objects. I'll lose the memories, but you'll have them in the pendant forever. Why? So they should be important to you. They should be part of your identity you want to be sure to protect. So think about what these items and what the memories would preserve about you. Let's do smell next. Find an object with a strong odor. <laughs> My armpit. And that holds a piece of you. Okay. <laughs> it can hold a piece of me if I wanted to. <laughs> um... Uh, a strong sense of smell. Okay, that's one option. Flowers. I want something funky. <laughs> Ginger drink. Uh, not, not funky enough. Oh, this game is a vibe. What's that? Granite. Seaside. seaside. Oh. Darkness. This speaks to how my mom loves me. Nah. I need something funky, boys. Honey, wax, baby, waves. What, baby? I was loved by people I have no memory of. I was loved by people. Bro, this game is too deep for me. <laughs> I'm still trying to digest. Uh, nah, nothing here. Uh, what's this? Nothing. I always looked for other worlds. Mm. That thing might be funky. The doll. <laughs> um, I'm thinking the, the beeswax thing. Yeah. Tangled nest, sour, sour clay. Sour sounds funky. It speaks to how my dad loved me. Uh, okay. I'm going to select this one. This sour mansion. <laughs> so it might smell funky. What did you choose for smell? A funky doll. Mr. Lotto. Let's breathe in deep. <laughs> Let's breathe in deep. <laughs> Sucks for you, mom. I'm used to the smell. <laughs> I remember. You used to take him everywhere with you. Ooh, he's gonna smell really bad. One night, you forgot him in the plaza. It was cold and rainy that night. But your dad leaped into action as if the doll was a real member of the family. I have this image of his face as he ran out into the storm, completely serious. No hesitation. And when your dad returned with the doll, I forgot for a moment that he's just fabric stitched into the form of an animal. So oh, she's going to forget it when she burns it. It felt as if he had a soul because you'd projected one into him. What was dear to you was dear to us. That was... We were whole for a little while. So she's going to forget it, but it's going to be independent. Now touch. Touch. Pick something with the texture you like. Texture. Uh, this could be anything, to be honest. Uh, nah. Not cool. Uh, maybe the book. You know why? Because maybe if I put it into the uh, pendant, I don't have to read it. <laughs> Where's the book again? The binding is loose. The lace of the cover a is ready to slip away. Catalog of strangers, yeah. How I always wanted to meet these strangers. We're gonna select this one, cause 
So what did you end up choosing? Yeah, maybe if we cook it, we don't have to read it. <laughs> it's just going to be independent. It's, <laughs> it's... Okay, feel the book. Mm -hmm. This book is supposed to make children afraid of the outside world. Every household has a copy. Wow. But it had its purpose in the old days. What with the chaos and violence and confusion. But it didn't work on you. You were scared of the images, but as soon as you could talk, you had questions. Are they hungry? Did they get enough sleep? Soon enough, the creatures became familiar. You dreamed of meeting them. They became your friends. Oh. Another moment when I began to realize what kind of person you are, that you were born to step outside of our lives here. Born to step outside. Okay, got it. You okay? I'm fine. Let's do sight next. Pick something sight. that that looks nice. Something that looks nice. Um, flowers. <clears throat> An unlit tower. I like this I was one. Loved by people I have no memory of. I was loved by people I have no memory of. So, what did you end up choosing? The candle. This kind of candle keeps someone alive for the time it takes to burn. This kind of candle keeps someone alive for the time it takes to burn? Just a few hours when death is nearby. Okay, wow. It can be enough for last rites, last words. This was grandma's candle. She didn't want to use Looks it. Looks good. You spent a lot of time with her when you were a baby. I realized she wouldn't live long enough for you to remember her, or for her to see you grow up and discover what kind of person you'd be. So in a way, you don't know her, and she didn't know you. And yet, she loved you. I don't know where love goes, but it belongs to you anyway. Burn it. It's like an RPG almost, where you pick. For taste, we can eat breakfast and feed some to the burner. Okay. I mean, waste of food, but... <laughs> yeah, I thought burner just meant guns. I guess this is not America. The memory I'll lose is the one we're forming right now. Memory I'll lose is the one we're forming right now. I want right you now. to have it forever. We're standing here, you're having a last taste of home. Now you're protected by lost memories. Protected by lost memories. Such a cool concept. A gem of home around you. Nice. This is my only condition for letting you go. My only condition for letting you go. You must promise me never to take the pendant off. Never. Ah, oh, okay. Got it. And never tamper with it. Never tamper with it. Yes, I'm confident. Okay. There's no try. And I'm okay with you leaving. Only yes. I think your camera and bag are still in your room. It's time to gather them up. She could have said it's time to get them, but she said it's time to gather. <laughs> Pick up tools and leave. Yeah, let's get out. See what's... Oh, she's got a list. Yo, that's a cool trip. Nah, the artwork looks really good. 
I've lost so much. How could the world ask me to lose you too? Oh, you can take pictures like that. She gonna burn me? Look at us. There we are. There we were. Oh no, we, we've already got a pendant, right? We'll always be right here on this beautiful morning. I gotta go. Home lever achievement unlock. Wow. I just performed a ritual with my mom. The moment has passed, but I'll record it in these pages for you for the future. I. How do I? Okay. How do I? <laughs> uh. View, listen, stop content. Undo, exit. Okay. I can't exit. Uh. Yo. What do I exit? This, uh, I can't get out of the diary. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, you can exit the keepsakes. Do I have to do something before I go? I just perform ritual with my mom. Oh, you have to do this, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, there's no instruction, so my bad. Goodbye ritual. The moment has passed, but I'll record it in these pages for you. Ah, okay, you have to do this first, I guess. You can't simply exit, I think. Oh, nice. Can do this. This nice. Oh, my bad. So, pendant. All right. Just put it here. Since she lost all her memories to make this pendant, right? Uh, yeah, put this here. Somewhere here. And the book over right here. Ah, oh, okay. This is okay. Now I, I get it. When my mom would share a memory of dad while cooking on a walk with no warning, it knocked the wind out of me. Rituals take this grief and give it a shape and a story. Filling in this journal is a ritual too, but for a loss that hasn't hit us yet. Okay, so that's what I had to do. Okay. <laughs> that's why I couldn't get out of the journal. I had to do that. Got it. I wish they, they instructed me to do that. I was panicking <laughs> like a fuck, like an idiot. It is what it is. Um, okay. Goodbye, ritual quotes. Okay, there's stories of strangers who became my friends. That ran out rain to save Mr. Lotto. Mom. 
mother's lost memories to protect my mind from diseases or you can edit these okay the future will hear what I heard oh man my layout thing is not good it's fine kind of squeeze in a little bit like so yeah okay oh you can have decorations and stuff wow interesting <laughs> this is this interesting as hell um yeah. Wow. You can do stuff like this. Like there's a design element to this game. Yeah. Okay. It's mad interesting. Now you can exit. I've okay. brought tools. Okay, to guys. The sights and sounds of this season. I'll start by recording the only place I've ever known. The only place I've ever known. Okay. Okay, I need better sensitivity. Um, 80%? Okay. Nah. Wow. Maybe a little more. Even the sound. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nice. Look at this. Can you run? Can you jump? Whoa. Oh, you can take pictures. Wow. Okay. And you can zoom. And focus this thing. Oh, you can focus range. Wow. Filter? There's filters? Ah, oh, come on now. Focus range. What a game. You can take pictures. I'm going to have a lot of fun in this game. Right, let's see the focus. We well, can do focus distance. You can have like a lot of uh, bokeh, bokeh, however you pronounce it. Nice. Ooh. Wow. Brilliant. Can you take a selfie? I guess not. Nice. I'm enjoying this. I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna spend hours just taking pictures. You can even focus on the background. You can focus on the foreground. Can change the focus range. Nice. Okay. Let's just walk. You can't run, by the way. Well, I don't think you can. At least not yet. Audio record. You have. Wow. You can record sound. Wow. Wow. 
what is this game? Whoa, look at that. How do I not take pictures of every single thing? You tell me. You can even have filter. Like, let's see. Black and white, sepia, cool, warm, pastel. Pistol is interesting. Last night, my friends wrote down their hopes for my trip and tied them to the branches of this tree. What? <laughs> wow. Last night, there was a goodbye party here in the plaza. Everyone was so afraid for me. To understand that fear, to understand where I grew up. You have to know the man standing Ooh. watch over the plaza, Dr. Fumio. The man standing over the plaza. Okay. Is it, is that the man? Right. Change pace. Whoa, look at that. Take a picture of that. Wow. That's wild. I'm enjoying this. This an okay picture. <laughs> Looks better in real life. Let's take a picture. Oh, wow. This whole village is scenic. Let's take a picture of this uh, statue here. See if we can frame it in an interesting way. Yeah, something like that. Put it right in the middle. I'm going with pastel for the whole game. I think. It's my thing, pistol. This is Dr. Fumio and his son. The statue isn't as old as it looks. The artist wore it down to give it a feeling of ancientness and the authority that comes with it. Dr. Fumio and his son founded Cairo back, back in 776. In they live on through our traditions. Okay. Take pictures and record video to find the answer. An instrument designed by there Dr. Are three Fumio. celebrating Dr. Fumio's work. Three murals. A wish fell off the tree. I'm not supposed to read them, but it might be good for you to have an example of one. What? <laughs> Am I not you? I hope she comes back and tells everyone it's safe to leave. I can go against tradition a little for posterity. Yeah, fancy words. You just want to steal things <laughs> and do bad things you're not supposed to do. What's this? Smell. It smells like an old man's toes dipped in cinnamon. <laughs> I had to drink this gross potion last night. Like my pendant, it's supposed to protect my brain. What's this? Pate loves fish, even though nobody here has ever seen one. I remember soaking my feet in here on hot days.
Nah, this game is beautiful. Look at that. See if we can take a picture. Yeah, something like that. I've taken a few pictures. I remember soaking. Not supposed to read this. Uh, my second omen. Should we go on with the game then? Fill journal with photos and recordings. Got it. Place enough keepsakes to unlock an inspiration. Which one do I like? Smell second old man's toes. This one? Okay. Um I like this picture. Um My friends tied their hopes for... To, okay. And... You could probably put this... Yeah. Yeah, something like that. So you kind of unlock... A village that was created as a place to heal. Is that where my instinct to try to help comes from? It's so strange to imagine I'll be shaped by places and people I haven't met yet. So strange to imagine that I might feel at home some. New stamps and conclusion unlocked. I should probably pair that with a. Uh... Wow. And you unlock stuff. Whoa. Look at that. Maybe I'll put a picture. Mm, which picture do I like? Hey, this one? Something like that. That's alright, right? This over that. I like this game already. Like, I like this game already. I love this game already. Look at that. Whoa. What's this? So you're pretty much just walking around, um, documenting stuff, right? So, what a concept. Alright, so I'm actually going to stop now. I've been playing long enough. I have to say, I, I can't wait to play more of this game. Like, look at this. Look at this view. Like, come on. Come on, man. It's too easy. Yeah, I'm in love with this game and the whole concept. And we haven't even started yet, okay? We had a bit of a scare with the journal, but maybe it's my fault. Like, <laughs> I just panic. 
to be honest. Um, yeah. So yeah, that's all for now. Um, thanks for watching. Peace.